Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You thought we were kidding. This episode is on Orange Home Depot Bucket. I'm Alexa. And I'm Max. <laughs> Attention all students and staff. The Snack Shack will be selling nachos that stroll through the park every Monday and Friday after school for just $2. Nachos will be sold every Monday and Friday for the rest of the year while supplies last. The Snack Shack is open after school today. Stop by to pick up your favorite snack. Hey guys, check out your 2022 to 2023 yearbook cover. Magic Prep is looking bright. Don't miss out on purchasing this year's amazing yearbook full of great memories. Yearbooks are on sale while supplies last. They can be purchased in the front office or online. Attention all middle and high school athletes. Cheer tryouts are, are approaching us. On May 15th and 16th, middle school will be from 4 p.m. to 6 p.m. and high school will be from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. On May 17th, middle school and high school will both be from 4 p.m. to 8 p.m. You must attend all three days of athletic with, scroll up. You must attend all three days of tryouts in athletic shoes and black attire. Please pick up a medical release and tryout packet from room 213. There are no stone birthdays today. Over the weekend, Andrew Smith, Mallory Marcillo, and Mrs. Holstrom all celebrated their birthdays. And today's celebrity birthday is Chase Hudson, who is apparently a TikTok star. <laughs> now handing off to weather with Jimena and Carly. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jimena. And I'm Carly. The weather today will be a high of 99 and a low of 74 with wind speeds of 10 miles per hour. In Austin, Texas, it will be a high of 84 and low of 68 with wind speeds of 4 miles per hour. Now to Gabe with a fun fact. I've been expecting you, but were you expecting this fun fact? The colors of Fruit Loops, Fruity Pebbles, and Trick Cereal are just visual flair added to make it look more colorful. In reality, all of those little flakes and stuff, they all taste the same. It's also the same, also, for the Fruit Loops, it's the same things they use for Apple Jacks. So everything you've been told in your childhood is a lie. Now back to your regularly scheduled chicanery with whatever those two are doing. Good afternoon, Imagine Prep. I'm Mr. McComb here with your Monday Minute. I am here with my longtime friend, Miss Carly. Carly, how are we doing today? Good, how are you? I am doing really well. Miss Carly, you are an extremely busy person. So yes. I know there's lots that we could talk about, but first I want to ask you about our Cambridge testing series. I understand that you've experienced that already and still have one coming up. So tell yes. me a little bit about where you're at and where you're going. Um, it was a very hard test and it was very much about preparation and having to think a step of ahead because we don't know what's on the test now. It's different from the last year. Sure. Teachers don't know. It's very much prepare for anything. Be what ready. test was that? Um, I took both bio and English. Okay, so those, those are some big ones. I know yes. uh, difficult, but uh, hopefully though, if you pass those, you'll be college ready in those subjects. Yes. So it'll boost your GPA, mm -hmm. it'll be on your transcript, mm -hmm. and it'll be a step towards the Grand Canyon diploma. Yes, and English was kind of easier because they send in your past portfolio. So any of the writings that we did this year already go towards that grade. That is awesome. You get a bump for that. I love it. I also understand that you kept book at baseball and were our team manager, right? And for you learned softball, a little bit about yes. that, softball. Uh, tell me what that experience was like. Um, it's very much about, even though I'm not playing, you still learn the game a lot. And it's very much a, you know what's going on sometimes even before the coaches do and you also make relationships with the umpires because they get to know you as keeping book so do you like give coach a heads up like on certain things that you're yeah, seeing like if that? this person hit a home run last time i'll let coaches know or even i'll let the players know at like two or three like hey the hit to you last time sure that's great that's awesome very good well thank you i know there's so much more we can yes. dig into but we only have a couple minutes here mm -hmm. so let's do a student mm -hmm. shout out real quick 
Uh, Riley Robbins. Yeah, Riley. Hope you're having a great day. And then a faculty shout out. Uh, Miss Carher. Yes, Miss Carher. You have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for being with us. Today is Monday, but tomorrow is Thursday.